dark chocolate. Oh, you're speaking my language now. Okay. <laughs> so dark chocolate. Can yeah. You eat, can you eat too much dark chocolate? That's the question. You know, I, I have never seen anything about an overdose of cacao, mm. but I will tell you that cacao has been shown to actually double the number of stem cells flowing in your bloodstream just by having two cups of hot chocolate made with 80% high flavanol chocolate, dark chocolate. Come on. Yeah, that's been done in people 60 year olds with heart disease. So wait, what happens when you when you drink or you you eat this dark drink. chocolate? Okay. What happens? Yeah. The polyphenols in this dark chocolate that we we know what they are. They're called proanthocyanidins. So I'm a scientist. So my job is to actually know what are what the inside chemicals actually are. Yes. These are natural chemicals. All right. Most people don't need to know that, but you drink it and it tastes good. That's all you need to know. But but I'll tell you, these, these natural chemicals found in cacao actually trigger a reaction in your body so that it, they call out the stem cells. So it is literally like bees flying out of a hive can double the number of stem cells. And what's the, what's the practical impact? Well, there was a study done uh, at UCSF in San Francisco that looked at 60 year old men with heart disease. So these are people whose blood vessels were already not doing so well and their blood flow wasn't going so well either. And their blood vessels were kind of sick. That's kind of the definition of heart disease. Mm -hmm. By having the stem cells coming out, they were able to actually double the resiliency, the function of their blood vessels. So they, they got better rebound, the better agility. Um, their, their blood vessels are in better shape because their stem cells are regenerating their circulation. 